penile attack penile attack is nothing but erectile dysfunction reduced blood supply in the penile vasculature which leads to inability to sustain an erection or having no erection why i am talking about penile attack or erectile dysfunction is because we have enough evidence to prove today that penile attack or erectile dysfunction in men is an earliest marker of myocardial ischemia or stroke and all this happens is because of the endothelial dysfunction endothelium is the innermost layer of the arteries of our body in fact endothelium also is the brain of the arterial system in our body endothelium is a is a layer innermost layer of the arteries it has lot of sensors and it also produces lot of mediators and this particular endothelium is responsible for dilating the blood vessels and allows the blood to flow inside the vital organs or in fact every organ of our body be it brain be it heart be it penis so a vascular endothelium is the most important organ of our body which is required for a normal vascular activity in the body friends we are living in a sex saturated society we are exposed to so much of erotic material be it television be it movies be it billboards be it newspapers be it magazines and be it even mobiles today handheld devices have also been uh, available to all of us and we can see all what we do not want to see or what we should not see but we are exposed to so much of erotic material and we are all born out of sex though we are in the sex saturated society we don't talk about it it's always there in our mind we don't talk about it because of the cultural taboos inhibitions we have been told right from birth that this is bad sex is sin sex is dirty so we don't talk about it and we hide or we try not to discuss this issues with anybody and we don't discuss these issues with our doctors and the sad part is today physicians also have their inertia and they also do not discuss anything about their sexual life of their patients with the patients themselves they will ask the histories of surgeries addictions allergies everything but they will not ask the histories of how they are in their sex life a very simple question if it is asked to the patients that do you have problems in making love will open up a pandora's box in fact friends you will not believe that your patients may be wanting you to ask this question they may be waiting for you to discuss or initiate a dialogue and it will be a great boon for them and for you to help them relieve or resolve these symptoms of erectile dysfunctions now why i say penile attack equates a, why it is very important for a very simple reason that when the onset of penile attack or erectile dysfunction occurs which is nothing but the endothelial dysfunction sooner or later due to atherosclerosis which is progressive even the coronaries get affected with the same thing and they also get blocked when they get blocked patients would get stable or unstable angina or heart attack they would also occlude the carotid arteries and these patients can get stroke so if we detect erectile dysfunction as early as possible we can predict that these patients could be eventually getting heart attack or stroke and the duration for which the onset of coronary artery disease and the erectile dysfunction is around 2 and 1/2 to 3 years so you have a window period of curability wherein you can change the lifestyle of your patients we can give them enough advices and medications to reduce the onset or retard the onset of critical events in his life we are vulnerable today we are exposed to so much of metabolic syndrome we have diabetes which is the sexual health tsunami of our century friends india is having around 72 million diabetics 
which is nothing but one third of the world population of diabetes we are closely competing with china though china is little ahead of us but india is almost the diabetes capital of the world and the commonest complication of diabetes in men is erectile dysfunction we have the tools we have the wisdom we must act now what i want to say today on this world sexual health day the 4th of september is that we must ask our patients and if we ask our patients about their sexual problems about their sex life by asking a very simple question that do you have problems in making love we can prevent or retard the onset of heart attack and that is why i say penile attack equates heart attack thank you very much